Today's collectible spot, we are having a look at the Funko Rock Candy Classic Supergirl. This vinyl figure is recommended for ages 14 and up. This is Spot's continued look at the rock candy figures, which still are some of my favorite Funko releases to date. Still not fans of the Dorbs, nor getting tired of the pop, but things such as the rock candy and also the Mopies are still something that's keeping me interested in the Funko. Above and beyond, of course, the Mystery Minis. Spot's still a big fan of those. So out of the box, we have Supergirl running down this side here and on the back. Not only do you get an image of the figure, but you also get a look at some of the other figures on here as well. Some of which we've looked at, such as the modern and classic Batgirl, as well as Harley Quinn. Figures we haven't looked at yet are classic Wonder Woman and Batman v Superman Wonder Woman, which Spot is still using these he's looking for in his stores. Finally, on the underside of the box, www.funko.com is your destination if you'd like to pick up or like to see some of the other releases that Funko are producing. Spot's going to take a break and get this opened up. When we come back, though, we're going to get a better look at the Rock Candy Classic Supergirl. It's more anyway, guys. Don't go anywhere. For accessories, Classic Supergirl comes with a clear display stand, two pegs on the tops, Nothing very complicated or decorative about the display stand. It's very neutral. Although I got to admit, the figure is stands just fine. Doesn't really need the display stand. But if you want to still accommodate it, she's got two peg holes on the undersides of her feet. Simply just line up, line up. And you want to make sure, actually one thing to point out is that the feet, the peg holes are varying sizes. Uh, you can see also as well the display stand has two different sizes as well. So uh, that will be a good indicator to you as to which peg goes on which foot. And we just want to line it up, line it up, line it up, line it up. I, I say that and I just ultimately put it on the wrong peg. Now, one thing though is let me just show you here on the underside of the display stand. This peg hole is clearly bigger than this one right here. It lines up perfectly fine with the foot. And yet for this one, even if I slightly tip it up, you can see it doesn't quite fit the foot until you have to stretch it. By stretching it, you then eventually can get it onto the peg hole, but it's uh, surprised that you have to put as much effort into it as you do. The finished look gives you something that looks like this, a much more stable. Granted, again, the other one, the other way, still stood perfectly fine. Um, as for articulation, she has none. Basically, the draw in the Raw Candy releases is that you get a pretty cool looking uh, rendition of uh, like a super stylized version of Wonder Woman or of Supergirl here. She has her classic uh, Superman colors light blue, the red skirt, the red boots, and of course the red cape. Um, she has a very heroic uh, expression on her face. The arms are bent as if she's about to fight crime or perhaps about to take off in flight. I have to ad ultimately admit though to you that it's not one of my personal favorites of the raw candy. Um, I think to even to this date, my personal favorites are still the modern Catwoman and modern Catwoman, the modern Batgirl, and as well the Harley Quinn. Those are two of my top favorites. I think the modern Batgirl is by far my favorite so far of these releases. Rock Candy also uh, categorized under the Rock Candy banner. They've released a bu bunch of Barbie releases as well, but the likelihood of Spot ever looking at Barbie raw candy figures are probably slim to none. I'll likely just stick to the superheroes, I think, when it comes to raw candy releases. Very simplistic in its design, still executed very well. Not my personal favorite from the lines, but I think classic Supergirl here still delivers what she needs to. And if you're a fan of raw candy figures, I think this is one that you would want to add to your collection. Today's toy spot, today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the Funko Rock Candy. This was classic Supergirl. Stay tuned, guys. Spot's going to have more collectible spots heading your way. As always, thanks for watching. See you next time.